Hello everybody, welcome back to Buy on the Road. No, it isn't winter. And yes, it is a big difference from the weather from last week. Uh, things are looking nice and white, which is actually kind of annoying. But, as you can see, there's now ice <laughs> on the inside of my car. As I said, there would be. Um, yes, it's cold. It isn't freezing, but it is cold. Anyway, this is how well my car starts on a cold day like this. Almost there, dude. <clears throat> Almost there. Almost there. There we go. Here comes the fog cloud from the exhaust. Yeah. Oh, by the way, see that little thing that just went under the fence? Yeah. Here, little thing yapping, that's it. Anyway, you just say it is cold. Everything is looking nice and white to where the sun hasn't shined yet. Um, yeah, that's the one of two things I genuinely hate about winter. My car frozen over and its own starting, and then other people driving when the weather is slippery. Either they have no confidence in their own driving skills or whatever, I don't know, but uh, of course, the first day where it froze, tons of accidents have happened already. Even though there was a proper warning the day before, watch out, it's going to be slippery tomorrow morning. No. Let's just pile up on one another. I believe it was a grand total of 10 or 11 accidents. Yep. Anyway, uh, let's talk terrorism. Why not, right? Um, here's a reason. Well, apparently our government is uh, shitting bricks as well. Because in the capital, they've shut down public transportation, schools, daycare centers, uh, I think some other stuff. So, yeah, they're really not you know, showing a strong united front. They're more like cowering away. Um, other than that, there's another guy peeing in the bushes. Enjoy that. Uh, what else? What else? Um, oh, yeah. Um, at Parliament, the military showed up. Just there, of course. I mean, the average joke can go suck itself for all they care. Um, someone told me that that's exactly where something should happen at Parliament. Because what do those friggin' government people do? Care about the common man? Nothing. Unless it's time to start voting. So, we have a few dudes get blown up. Oh no, tragedy. Oh no. And a week later, nobody cares anymore. I have a few of those friggin' ministers die. Then we'll probably start seeing some changes because then they'll be shitting their asses. Now they're stuck up in parliament behind a fence of soldiers, not having a care in the world. Uh, such is life, right? managed to survive a year and a half without Parliament, so, or government or whatever it is you call that. So I really don't think we're in too much of a problem, should go down for quite a while again, but hey, they control the country, why should they be the ones that have to deal with us? They sit high and mighty upon their pedestal, 
<coughs> preaching that they have the best intents for us, but when you look at it, it's their own safety they are concerned about. We've posted militaries where, well, the places we go. Now, okay, congrats. I don't know. They now have people who are start calling in bombs when there are no bombs. I mean, we can't say who it's from, but last three days, like five or six bomb reports, nothing was found. So we've now got to the point where we panic and do all sorts of stuff when there's actually nothing wrong. I get you shouldn't be taking those bomb threats lightly. Yeah, sure, but. I'm not entirely sure that if terrorists are planning to cause as much casualties as they want, they're just casually going to phone in that there's a bomb. Yeah, well. Maybe I'm just the only weird one in this situation. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> my car is in the sun, so it might be getting defrosted a bit more. And I'll see you guys when I get back. There. Look at that. Clear vision, no ice on the windows. And, oh, wait, there's some more. Never mind. Anyway, uh, I can't see very well here. Oh, I can. Cool. You might hear a bag fall over. It's pretty full and it isn't really that well fastened to the. Yeah. You know. <clears throat> hope it doesn't happen. If it does happen, I'll have some cleaning up to do. Or put it in back in the bag. It's not like it's gonna spill stuff all over my trunk, which it has done before. But that was usually with uh, empty glass that needed to be recycled. Why do people never get the last bit out of their bottles, huh? Yeah. That's just bad. For everyone involved. Anywho, we're not doing the detour, apparently. Which is fine. I've already spent a good amount de-icing the car for most of it, so yeah. Also took precautions and took groceries for two days with me, meaning I won't have to go through this tomorrow, normally. That happened once. Yeah, take the stuff with you for tomorrow as well, so you don't have to go to the store tomorrow. And then when it was tomorrow, I had to go to the store twice, because, oh, we still need this, and so I brought, I had to go for that. And I came back, oh yeah, we also need that. Did you go after that as well? So, uh, the great thing was, the person actually said, yeah, I thought about it the moment you left. You could have called me, you know? Yeah. You could have called me and told me that. But no. In any case, the trees are looking a little less leafy. It's not winter yet, it's still November, so. But, uh, yeah. It's definitely not that lush green anymore that you can see in spring and summer. More of an autumn -y yellow. And in a good month, it'll probably be just straight up nothing anymore. It sticks. Sun's in my eye, which is great. That's another problem about winter. Well, all of as well as low hanging sun. I mean, you got your visory things to keep the sun out of the butt. If the sun's that low, it's not going to be any good. Yeah. 
Yeah, an update on uh, today's terror threat. Who knows where we are when this actually gets uploaded, but it might be all gone or it might just have gotten worse. That's shit. Okay. Uh, and this is uh, where I'm going to cut it. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to show support by commenting, liking, and subbing. Feel free to use the comment section below to talk about stuff, any stuff you would like to. And I'll be seeing you guys all in the next episode. Bye, everyone.